Having read somewhere that BF-998 will do a better job as an RF amplifier than its 996 counterpart, so I thought maybe it's time to build a simple receiver and see what happens. Five electronic blocks take part in the experiment to turn a wave into audio wave. The 998 is assigned to do the RFM, the 996 to do the mixer, and one low cost junction fed to do local oscillator that can generate 82 to 88 MHz. With the configuration shown here, the 998 is put under test to observe its drain current at different bias voltage on gate 2. According to the test, voltage 7.3 volt at gate 2 yield drain current of 10 mA, which is the setting used in this experiment although it seems the device should perform better at 6 volts. This is a simple circuit diagram that was used to produce a copper clad circuit board for the front end section. It would be equally interesting to see if RF coupling from the 998 to the 996 can be accomplished by installing two coils in close proximity to each other like this. The actual current readings from the devices after they are assembled to the PCB are as shown here. The yellow shade shows metal shielding in different areas of the prototype. And once more, the popular LA1235 is attached to the front end prototype to do FM demodulation. Here is how ugly such prototype can look like. The microcontroller is installed to switch the transmitter on and off in the other room of the house. Such transmitter is intentionally 110% FM modulated with a 1.3 kHz audio tone. Here is how that kind of modulation sounds like at the prototype receiver.